by Demix. Your boss intro, like, where all the water flying up is one of the coolest Anyone things. Anyone from the organization who'd like to be next? Hey, Sarah. Go on, colonize them. Yeah, we gotta go help our friends out first. But they're the antagonists. Oh, sorry. Then let's go. Aha! Uh -huh, there you are. <laughs> I saw you fighting that weird guy with a guitar. You sure have lots of friends to help. Yep. So, I guess we better all pull together and finish this battle for good. Yes, yes Your Majesty. Majesty. Oh yeah, this part's really dumb. Come on, wake up! I'm sorry about the ice cream. Really? Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, uh, this is not happening. It can't be happening. It can't. They'll pay for this. Although that part's cool. Yeah, the game really tries to convince you that Goofy dies. Plot twist, he doesn't die. <laughs> There's no way Disney would let them get away with that. So, we don't have Goofy in our party anymore, and um, Donald's about to ditch us as well. Anyhow, we got a new ability, Defender. <laughs> We're not going to equip it, though. Donald got a new ability, Blizzard Boost. Yeah, equip that instead of Thunder Boost. That's, that's better. Alright, the one annoying thing, though, is... If we are, we're about to fight a series of Heartless fights that are actually kind of tough, if we lose to them, we have to beat Demix again. I guess that's the other annoying thing. Defeat all the Heartless, and Donald has ditched us. Thanks, Donald. However, Yuffie's here as a temporary partner. She's pretty good. She can hit all of the Heartless easily, and she can heal us. But then again, the Heartless here are all pretty darn good. Take that. Rising Sun! Reaction Command! Take that. Yeah, so these are like the Final Fantasy fights, because each one of these Heartless fights, we get a Final Fantasy member, or a Final Fantasy character as our partner. So for this fight, we get Leon again, but again, Leon kind of stinks. Oh, never mind, Leon. Okay, you're actually doing a lot. Then again, these are Shadows who are like super easy. That's a Morning Star! Get the Morning Star! Thank you, Reflect. We can also use uh, Limit Form for this fight. Alright, I'm- Leon's like, you trash talk my abilities? Sorry, Leon, I didn't- I, I, I am so sorry. And Tifa's a party member. Tifa might be the best party member in the whole game. She's super aggressive, very powerful, and basically invincible. She doesn't stagger from damage at all. Yeah, I think we're gonna go with it for Thanks, Tifa! Those morning stars, though, man. They're tough. And here we have Cloud. Cloud is also one of the best party members. Oh, they're not security robots. Oh boy, morning stars. Alright. Let's go! 
Dang, Cloud. Yeah, Cloud's just wrecking everything. Thanks, Cloud? <laughs> Alright, that was the last one. Are you okay? Yeah, Cloud took care of everything. Uh, I'm fine, but... I'm guilty. Hey, Veros! <laughs> Two minutes later, he's okay. Goofy! Like, the only reason they did that was to add unnecessary drama and to have Mickey have the awesome, like, they'll pay for this moment. <laughs> you know, that really hurt. Aw, Goofy. Gorse, your majesty, I get bumped on the head all the time. <laughs> Gorse, your majesty, I die all the time in these games, but then I just come back to life after, like, 60 seconds pass. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. That hurt too. You missed, Donald. I'm going to ever do that again. Mickey's like, oh boy! We did it! And we get another cure element. Restores HP used from the magic command, costs all MP. So now cure will refill all of our HP, unless I'm mistaken. And we get Goofy back in the party, like literally two seconds later. I'm glad everyone's alright, but we can't relax just yet. We have to rally together for all our friends' sakes. Sometimes we get spread up like we were earlier and can't help each other. At times of day, try using your enemies to fight. Why did you ditch me, Donald? We all could have fought at the same time. <laughs> oh, yuck! I don't know what happened, but sorry if I made you worried. <laughs> what could happen next? We better prepare ourselves for anything. <laughs> you guys are really stupid to think that I actually died. And here we get an energy crystal in this chest. We get the great Ma map. <laughs> Ma! You're great. And then in this chest, Mickey, let me open the chest. We get everyone's favorite, more torn pages from Winnie the Pooh's book. <laughs> I know that's my favorite. Anyhow, let's head out to the Great Maw. We're in for one doozy of a battle. But it's one of the coolest parts of the game. Huh? What's with them? Hey, bros. That's a lot of Heartless. Hey! Sorry, I was busy walking down a thousand stairs. It's the leader. You mean it's his nobody? The leader of Organization 13. Wait a minute. Now I know! Wise Ansem, I am here to seek your advice. I'm glad we have the opportunity to speak like this, my friend. I'm intrigued by your hypothesis, and I'm finding it difficult to stave off the urge to test it. Still, I'm concerned about the stability of the world. I love how he's just, like, having this really serious scientific discussion, and he's just eating a popsicle. Yep. That's what worries me, too. The doors that appeared. The place the heartless seek. I fear my research may have brought this upon us. Master Ansem. Regarding the experiment I presented the other day, with your permission, I'd like to proceed. I forbid it! Forget this talk of doors and the heart of all worlds. That place must not be defiled. But Master Ansem, I've been thinking. They are not. Those thoughts are best forgotten. Oh, that's something else they changed in Final Mix. He had red eyes in 
uh, in the original release, but I guess they changed them to gold to uh, fill in a plot hole that was caused. Yes, someone having red eyes instead of gold caused a plot hole. Now I remember. Xehanort, Ansem's apprentice. The leader of Organization 13 is Xehanort's nobody. Let's go! Move it! We got what Xehanort did away! Right! You guys ready for this? It's time for the Battle of a Thousand Heartless. Defeat all the enemies. There are a thousand Heartless here. We have to kill all of them. However, the security robots help out with their Sparkle Ray Reaction Plan. And also, not all of the a thousand Heartless have been loaded in yet. A lot of them are, again, just animated images, not actually full-on enemies with AI and such, because that would completely crash the PS2, <laughs> if they were. In fact, that would probably crash the PS4 if they all were as well. So yeah, we can literally just keep on doing this reaction command over and over again, and we just obliterate the Heartless. This is the easiest way to deal with it. And this is, and this is why the enemies are so weak, and this is also why they only give you 13 experience points per enemy, because if they gave any more, we could just get an insane amount of experience, and sometimes that happens. The Rising Command, the Rising Sun Reaction Command is also pretty good, but it's not as good as Sparkle Ray. As you can see, we've already killed almost 700 Heartless. Can you imagine how hard this fight would be in Kingdom Hearts 1? <laughs> Ouch! as it sounds, if not more so. Charlie. Take that. And we get guard break for clearing the Thousand Heartless. And we feel like a boss now. And Sora's exhausted afterwards, which is perfectly reasonable. Where the heck were you two? <laughs> we were all together in our hour. We each killed a Thousand Heartless. <laughs> yeah, right, Donald. <laughs> Where's the king? Come on! <laughs> <Your majesty. laughs> Thanks, guys! I was gonna kill him in secret from behind! <laughs> How long has it been since I abandoned that name? Out with it, nobody! Where's Kyrie? Where's Riku? I know nothing of any Kairi. 
As for Riku, perhaps you should ask your king. Well, there goes the king. He's gone. Now we have to go to Atlantica! <laughs> no, we don't, Sora! We can just give up. Yeah, I think we'll do that. Sora, do do. Hey, the Black River, we that was the Thousand Heartless. We destroyed them all. What's going on? Way to fall right into their trap. Hey, Axel. Come on, it's a setup by Organization 13. Xemnas is using you to destroy the Heartless. That's his big master plan. Slamless? The guy you just saw. He's their leader. Got it memorized? X-E-M-N-A-S. Organization 13 wants to get rid of the Heartless? <laughs> yeah, they suck. Everyone hates them. <laughs> Man, you're slow. Every heartless slain with that keyblade releases a captive heart. That is what the organization is after. So what do those guys gonna do with the hearts? Make the best Valentine's Day cards ever. I'm not telling. Tell us! You! You're the one who kidnapped Kyrie! Bingo. The name's Axel. Got it memorized. Where is Kyrie? Please, just tell me. Look, about Kyrie, I'm sorry. Axel. Oh, it's Creepy uh -oh. Scar Guy. <laughs> uh oh. We'll ensure he receives the maximum punishment. I don't care about any of that. Just let me into the realm of darkness, okay? If it's Kyrie you're worried about, don't. We're taking very good care of her. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna trust the evil guy in the black cloak with the X scar on his forehead. <laughs> That's just a birthmark. <laughs> Why does everyone say it's creepy? <laughs> Take me to her. Is she that important to you? Yeah, more than anything. Show me how important. <laughs> Go to Atlantica if you want to show if you want to show me how important she is. She doesn't matter that much. <laughs> Please. So you really do care for her. In that case, the answer is no. All right, really. You run! Kill him. <laughs> Are you angry? Do you hate me? Then take that rage and direct it at the Heartless. This guy is a grade-A crud butt, in case you couldn't tell. Pitiful Heartless, mindlessly collecting hearts. And yet, they know not the true power of what they hold. The rage of the Keyblade releases those hearts. They gather in darkness, masterless and free, until they weave together to make kingdom hearts. And when that time comes, we can truly, finally exist. Oh yeah, also, I'm not sure if I mentioned this, Kingdom Hearts is something different in, like, basically every Kingdom Hearts game. In the first game, it's like, it's the heart of all worlds in this one. It's like, it's the world with all hearts. Then in future games, it's something totally different as well. What in the world do you think you're prattling on about? Kingdom Hearts belongs to me. The heart of all kingdoms. The heart of all that lives. 
A dominion fit to be called Kingdom Hearts must be my dominion. <laughs> Who the heck are you? Maleficent, no! No more Heartless! I do not take orders from you! <laughs> oh no, soldiers. <laughs> what will I do? Tusks aren't that powerful! Oh no! While I keep these creatures at bay, you devise a way to vanquish them forever! Maleficent. Do not misunderstand me. I shall have my revenge on you yet. Maleficent! Leave now. I don't take orders from you. <laughs> but what about... Who cares if Maleficent dies? She's evil. <laughs> now then, where did we leave off? I get that he has control over the nobodies, but why do they also have control over the Heartless? This doesn't make any sense. Which side are you guys on, anyway? The Heartless ally with whoever's the strongest. You have no heart. Oh, is that why they ally with you? They're like, ugh, he doesn't have a heart. No point in getting him. <laughs> Yes, Sora. Extract more hearts. No! The hearts! Just have Goofy bash them to death with his shield. Maybe everything we've done... Maybe it was all for nothing. What am I supposed to do if I can't use the Keyblade? Imbeciles! You can't be trusted to do anything. Huh? And we get Secret Ansem Report number one. And then we die. Sora! Donald! Goofy! Relax. Those three aren't going down that easily. <laughs> they whooped the my butt. Key Blade's chosen one. Hearts one. And Chain of Memories. He's a lucky kid. <laughs> <laughs> sure he is, Cloud. See you soon. <laughs> you owe me treasure. <laughs> Sora knows the truth now. The more heartless that he defeats, the closer he is to becoming our perfect puppet. This new knowledge will make him that much harder to control. What does it matter, really? Whatever his circumstances, Sora has never been able to help himself from saving people from the Heartless. It's what his pure little heart wants. There. The dice have been cast. Things are in motion. He can't stop this. Nothing is set in stone. If the dice aren't in your favor, it will share Demix's fate. The fun is in not knowing. Isn't it? What is the point of betting on something if you already know the outcome? Are you sure that defeating him won't derail the organization's plan? If he is to die so easily, he is of no use to us. But he's exactly playing a critical what I wanted to hear. It's not in my nature to hold back. I guess sometimes help comes from unexpected places. Sure does. 
Why do we have this unnecessary flashback now? This should have just been part of the original cutscene when we saw it, like, five seconds ago. Maybe everything we've done... Maybe it was all for nothing. What am I supposed to do if I can't use the Keyblade? Imbeciles! You can't be trusted to do anything. Huh? <laughs> Like, there's no point in just making this a flashback. They should have just shown this all, us all this at once. A lot of weird design decisions for this game, but the combat is amazing. What's this place? It must be the realm of darkness. We can't see anything. <laughs> Kyrie! Riku! Santa? <laughs> Be my Valentine. Are you sure you want to open? Oh, that's weird. <laughs> Gorge! It's the gang from Twilight Town. There's Hainer, Hence, Olette, and, uh, um... Roxas. No. The name just popped into my head. This is Roxas. Are you sure you want to eat? <laughs> I eat when I'm upset, okay? <laughs> Might have been poisoned. I trashed that guy into black crumb. What? <laughs> Chunky, no, sweet. <laughs> and are you ready for one of the weirdest ones yet? This stick of ice cream reveals the next keyhole. <laughs> In pitch blackness. For no reason. <laughs> Not sure what the, what the organization for a team member wanted to do. He's like, I have a box of ice cream and a weird picture for you, Sora. <laughs> wink, wink. Not yet. I gotta look for Kyrie. And we get ice cream. The, clearly the most important item in the Kingdom Hearts series. Ice cream found inside the box. Mmm, it's refreshing and tastes really good. And we get a picture. A picture found inside the box that shows Hainer and the Gain in front of the old mansion in Twilight Town. Oh yeah, this is the Pop Rocks that were stolen in like the first episode. And now we clear Hollow Bastion again. A photo and some ice cream. Hmm, wonder if there's some sort of clue. And who would have left them for us anyway? Riku? You think? Just this feeling I got. Yeah! Hey, what if the Heartless are back again? I can't use the Keyblade. That would only help the organization. But Sora, I think you have to use it. If we don't fight them, the Heartless will keep on hurting folks. He's right. Anyhow, that's it for this episode of Kingdom Hearts. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'm Carl Farty. Tune in next time. We're gonna go back to Hollow Bastion because we've got, um, we need to prove, prove a story to continue. Also, you'll notice now, the ways are blocked again. There are also new places we can go. So how it works is we're basically now a little more than halfway through the game. Yeah, there's so much more of the game. Now we get to go back to every single world that we went to beforehand and do a second slightly shorter story than we did the first time. So, and unfortunately we have to go back to every world, except Timeless River, which is my favorite one. Yeah, that's, that's annoying. So we could go to Port Royal, we could go to Agrabah, Agrabah. We can go to Port Royal, we can go to Land of Dragons, or we can go to Beast's Castle. And depending on which one you go to first, you get a different reward. If we go to the Mulan world, that's the battle world. That's the one with the lowest battle level, so it'll be the easiest, and we get a Thunder upgrade there. Beast's Castle's a little harder with a very tough boss at the end, but we get a new Keyblade that's actually really, really 
good. And if you go to Port Royal first, you get a Magnet upgrade. And you also, on top of that, get access to a new summon and the best limit in the whole game. However, it's also going to be the hardest at this point. So I think we'll do Land of Dragons first and then Beast's Castle, and then we'll see if we from there. Look forward to that next time on Kingdom Hearts 2. Until we meet again, my friends, have a great day, and God bless.